All right, so I am hungry for breakfast, and we have found ourselves in Where's Valley at Hillbilly's Restaurant. Hillbilly's. We've been wanting to come out here and try it for quite some time. It's been open for several years. We just haven't had a chance to really come out and eat breakfast. Today we did. So, Hillbilly's Restaurant, today we review you. Yeah, located in the heart of Where's Valley, you'll find our friends Hillbilly's Restaurant. My good friend Jeff over there. Go see him today. I'm glad you did. As you go inside, like many country little restaurants in here, it's a very quaint little country location here, surrounded in the heart of the Smoky Mountains. Some really delicious food here, so yes, anything from your regular pancakes to you name it, they have it. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner, actually, I will say, I can't go wrong. Breakfast anytime, but you got to get there before 2 o'clock. Good, good food. I love this menu. You see rabbit food. <laughs> I love the way some of these names are in some of these places. But yes, yeah, support local businesses, folks. They need them. I really appreciate people like you coming in, taking advantage of some of this delicious home southern cooking at its finest in the heart of Where's Valley and our friends at Hillbilly. So now, let me tell you a couple things. Have you ever had orange Danish rolls? Okay, well, these things are insanely good, and they are, but for Christy, she can't have them because they got cinnamon. Yeah, sorry, baby, but I can. Ha <laughs> ha! They give you a couple of them, so I guess one each for each person sitting down at the table, and they were fantastic. So, great little start right off the morning with some coffee and some orange juice, a glass of water, and these delicious orange Danish, uh, but they do have cinnamon in them, so. Yeah, man, look at that good stuff. Oh, yeah. Those are big. Look at this. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> perfect. As long as there's no cinnamon, it's good. Perfect. 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 Thank you. All right, shout out to my buddy Ethan. Ethan, thank you. Great food. Great service. I always say this. Shout out to the back of the house. Staff working in the back. You know who you are. Thanks for cooking such a great breakfast, like these scrumptious little fluffy eggs, delicious bacon, and some, <laughs> that's right, warm moonshine syrup there. Tell them there, it sure is, warm moonshine syrup. Yeah, so it's 3275 Wares Valley Road there in Sevierville, Tennessee, but it really is Wares Valley. That's their address, but the heart of Wares Valley, that's the total for today enjoyed my delicious food and of course there was two coffees on there but that was a mistake and Ethan took care of that and well as we get a local discount for being locals in the area so really 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 great food and again I'm so glad to see friends like that I worked with both of these two gentlemen years ago at the Margaritaville and I'm so glad to see not only them two working together uh, but to also see them having this little restaurant and be able to still work together after all these years so shout out to both Ethan and Jeff great food great service great people great location you can't have it any better in the heart of the great smoky mountains and as you walk around you can tell this place is just a cute little quaint place it's not uh, one of those huge places you walk in and it's cavernous but got a lot of seating in there got a lot of accommodation so if you come in you see it might be a little busy just wait i did notice that on the front uh, i don't know if they're going to be doing seating but it seems like there might be places out there to sit out if you're waiting though for sure if not, it does look like it holds quite a good amount of people. They do have some merchandise. And I did want to tell you the story real quickly about all the signatures Jeff shared with me, and especially the truck that is the showcase in the center. The reason I wanted to feature this on top of the food, see all the signatures that are on top of that? This truck is completely covered up with signatures. In fact, it got so many signatures that they started to have it put dollar bills and denominations of bills, like you'll see some Canadian dollars and other ones. And people actually started signing that and uh, close pinning it. So now it's a tradition if you go and you'd like to do that. And all of the money is donated to a veteran. I could not remember exactly what they said, so I don't want to say something wrong, but it's some type of a veteran's charity per the owner. You might want to ask your server or go in there and ask Jeff today. He can explain you the story, but look at all those signatures on that truck that led to something really, really awesome like that to be able to collect money for uh, seniors. In fact, there's a certificate of appreciation that tells you all about it right up at the front. But anyway, as we head out, i got to tell you, it was a great, great little experience, especially to rekindle a friendship with people I hadn't seen in a while. That meant the world. And uh, again, uh, the food itself, insanely good. So anyway, Christy's telling me to look up and show you guys again the cool little uh, light fixtures 
people with a country theme. Old porcelain stuff you'd see in grandma's kitchen. Some of the mason jars, things like that. So, <laughs> all right. I guess I better round Christy up and head outside, and we'll tell you guys our final thoughts. Coming right up on We Review You. I'm glad to be a hillbilly. <laughs> that place was so cool. The character in there was just oh, so, so authentic. I'm just going to go ahead and give a shout out to my good friend Jeff. Jeff, congratulations on this business out here. Many years yeah. of success to you. Uh, you guys, if you come out here, one of my old friends I used to work with, uh, Margaritaville, and my server friend Ethan. Ethan, I'm so glad to see you again. You guys are awesome. Great memories of you at Margaritaville, and now great memories again at a new place called Hillbillies. You guys may have never seen it before. Um, they were closed a couple times throughout the year. They're back in full force. In fact, as I pan around, uh, the owner actually owns the burger joint right next door, which we will be reviewing soon. We'll do that one soon. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that, but great food. So I'm going to go ahead and tell you mine. I had an omelet. It was three eggs with all the meat they could find in the kitchen. It had ham, sausage, uh, bacon. It had everything in it. Fluffy, fluffy eggs. Yeah, uh, good, good. Oh, cheese. And then sourdough bread. And it was a great choice. And then I also got, uh, I told Ethan, choose either between grits or gravy. I told Ethan, you choose for me. He went with the gravy. Great choice, Ethan. That really tasted good. Yep. And great fresh hot coffee. And uh, Christy, I want to taste some. So you saw, I'm going to put it up here real quickly right now, that truck. Uh, see the truck that we're showing. What a great story before we forget. Guys and gals, if you go in there and you see this truck, and you'll notice there's dollar bills on there. Let me pause while these motorcycles go by. Hello. So uh, let me tell you guys real quickly, uh, those dollar bills are really cool. They've raised to date almost eight, almost 9,000 actually dollars. For veterans. For veterans. They I donate the that. money. It's a wonderful cause. And that truck, if you'll notice, is full of signatures. Yeah. And because of the fact there's no more places to sign, now there's a new tradition. You can hang a dollar bill and they will donate that money to that veterans cause. So yeah. great on you guys for doing that, giving back. Wonderful cause. But great food. Now, they open from 8 till 2 o'clock, Monday through Sunday. And it's right here on the main strip, as you yeah. can hear the cars. They're open every uh, day. 321 right here. That's right. Uh, Christy's right coming around. We're right here on the main drag in uh, Where's Valley, uh, right across the street from uh, Exit Real Estate Pros. But you can see there's the big hillbilly sign and the truck hanging in the air. You can't miss it. Right next door is Sloppy Hog Burger Joint, owned by the same person that owns here. We're going to try that next. But today was on Hillbilly's Restaurant, and I gotta tell you, it was absolutely phenomenally good. So, Christy. Yeah, my breakfast was good too, by the way. Yes, you had the orange juice, you had some really big pancakes. Bring out you maple syrup that is heated. Heated maple syrup. I love that little extra bonus. Yeah. It's a really, we would definitely be back. I know we say that a lot, but we were really. In a heartbeat, I definitely would. So, all right, well, listen, thanks again. It was a great food, great. We really enjoyed ourselves, and thank you guys so much. We had a great time out here. We'll definitely be back. So, you guys, if you can, Support our local friends here in the Wares Valley community. If you're on your way, say you're going to Metcalf Bottoms or maybe you're in between the Pigeon Forge and the mountains, come out here and get you a good belly full of breakfast. If you come before 2, if not from 4 to closing, they're open for dinner. And from what I heard, meatloaf. We're going to try dinner here. So yep. we'll do another review on that yep. as well so in the future. Shout out to great local businesses. Hidden gems like Hillbillies right here in Wares Valley, Tennessee. From Sean and Christy and We Review You, thanks for watching. Tune in again for many more reviews videos right here on we review you like it. see you later hey thanks again so much for your support and watching our videos and don't forget to like comment and share our videos out there if you find somebody that's coming to the area and want to know a little bit more have them tune into our channel hit that subscribe button let youtube know that you enjoy the videos and there's more coming up like this video or this video right here on we review you